video super sneaky too it helps you to convert from feet and inches for people's height into meters this comes up in virtually every test paper so it's well worth learning once you've learnt the skills it's quite an easy answer to que a question to answer even okay to do these you need to know two facts in your head because they will not give you these in the actual um, test you need to know that one foot is the same as 30 centimeters on your ruler, you've got one foot on one side and you've also got 30 centimetres if you flip your ruler over. So they are virtually the same length. Each foot in old imperial measurements is broken up into 12 little inches. And as, to be as close as you need to be, you need to remember that an inch is 2.5 centimetres. That's as close as you need to get. So if you remember these two facts, you'll be able to answer virtually any of these questions without many difficulties. If you don't remember these facts, they will be impossible because they don't give you these facts in the questions. So here's our first example. Let's imagine Bert is six feet and five inches tall. We have to give his height in metric measurements and in multiple choice 11 plus, you're usually given five choices. Here are our five choices at the bottom. So let's start by working out what six feet would be in centimetres. So six feet would be six lots of 30 centimetres because a foot is, is 30 centimetres. That would give us 180 centimetres. Now for the slightly harder bit, let's do five inches. That would be five lots of 2.5 centimetres. Well, um, if we do that as a little sum up in the corner, 2.5 times five, you might be able to do it in your head, but rely on a sum if you're not too confident. Five times five is 25, and then two times five is 10, add two is 12. So we've got for that 12.5 centimetres. Be careful to line them up correctly as you're adding them up. Right, we've got our 0 0.5 in this column here. Two, we've got nine, and we've got one. So altogether, Bert is 192.5 centimetres. Now, that's not the answer. The answer is the rounded answer, one of the ones from below. Now, he is going to be between 1.9 and two metres. But which one's he closest to? Well, this one, this digit here, tells you that we have to round down to 190 centimetres or 1.9. If this digit was 5 or above, we would round up to 2 metres. So the correct answer is this one here. Let's try Martha. Now Martha is 4 feet and 3 inches tall. So first of all, the feet. 4 times 30 centimetres would give us 120 centimetres. 3 inches, we would have 3 lots of 2.5 centimetres, which is 7.5 centimetres. Add those together, we get our 0.5 at the end, and we get 125, so 127.5 centimetres. If we did have to round that, it would probably be rounded to 1.3 metres, if it's like the question before. Okay, what about Archie? Archie is 5 feet and 10, 11 inches tall. Now there's a bit of a sneaky way of doing this because it's quite fiddly to work out 11 lots of 2.5. So what you could do is pretend that Archie was 6 foot tall. Now if he was 6 foot tall, that would be 6 times 30, which is 180 centimetres. Now... 5 foot 11 is just one inch short of 6 foot, so all we have to do is take away 2.5 centimetres, which will give us 177.5 centimetres, and that would usually round to 1.8 metres. A nice shortcut there. 